Hello everyone and welcome back to a new video. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can delete games on Epic Games Launcher. So if you guys want to learn how to do it, just follow the steps that I'm going to show you. As you can see guys, I'm right now in Epic Games Launcher and this is how the homepage looks like. So right here in the left side of your screen, you're going to find Store, Library and also Unreal Engine. So firstly, you go ahead and click on Library. Once you're here in your library, you're going to find all of your purchased games. And right here, as you can see, guys, in the right, you can search for the title of the game you want to find. Right here, you can also filter by genre, features, types, and or platforms. And if you want to see only your installed games, go ahead and click on installed. And then you're going to find the list that includes all of your installed games. You can also sort by recently played, recently purchased, A to Z, and so on. So, for example, as you can see, guys, this game, if you want to uninstall it, just go ahead and click on the three dots right here. And then, as you can see, guys, you're going to find all of the options related to this game. Here, you're going to find go to store page, add to favorites, add to collection, explore add ons, options, manage, uninstall. So, if you want to delete the game, just go ahead and click on uninstall and then they're going to ask you, are you sure you want to uninstall the game? This will delete it from your system. If you are sure, go ahead and click on uninstall and then you're going to be able to delete the game. Also, if you want to delete some specific files to reduce the size of the game, just go ahead and click on the three dots right here, then click on options right here. And then as you can see guys right here, I can remove some features to reduce the size of the game. So by unchecking, for example, the boxes right here, you're gonna be able to reduce the size as you can see guys right here. So once you finish, go ahead and click on apply and then all of the changes will be saved. So this is it guys for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next video.